them at a really excellent engineering school and also a school that uh, combines the sort of the engineering and technology component with the liberal arts and understanding that all of that is needed. Why is that important to me? Because right now I'm working on a project called 100 Year Starship, which is all about making sure the capabilities exist to send humans to another star within a 100 years. And that capability requires the full spectrum of human experience, our skills, our talent, whether you talk about from uh, propulsion physics all the way to culture and behavior to arts and, and, um, and film and storytelling. Dr. Mae Jemison was the first African-American female in space with the NASA program. To have a, 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 an astronaut, a scientist of her caliber here at Clarkson University is an honor and a treat for the entire Clarkson community. It's a phenomenal value. It's a phenomenal benefit for Clarkson University students to have this opportunity. To be able to be in this sort of atmosphere, this intimate setting uh, with an astronaut, uh, living astronaut, uh, someone who they can pose questions to and really get a sense of her psyche and really what, the mean, what this means to her, uh, it's unbelievable. The other thing I want people to understand and I always talk about is that technology is just a tool and tools are designed by people for different reasons. And so it's really important that we have a wide diversity of people involved in designing the tools. Also a wide diversity of people involved in asking the questions that lead to the knowledge that get us to the tool design. I think of art as being us telling a story that not everyone experiences. And I think of the sciences, the physical sciences, as being something that can be experienced by everyone.